All right, everyone, welcome back to my channel, Baseball Talk with Nick Morgan. So just the other day, Major League Baseball announced the 2020 Gold Glove Award winners for this past regular season. And in today's video, I'm going to go ahead and tell you who won the awards at each position in both the American League and National League. Now, we do have Platinum Glove Award voting going on right now. So some of these guys are going to win Platinum Gloves based off of their amazing defense in the 2020 season. The next time we see awards being released, and announced it's going to be for the Rookie of the Year, Manager of the Year, Cy Young, and MVP. We will cover all of that here on the channel as well. If you guys are ready for the Gold Glove Award winners, don't forget to go ahead and drop a like down below, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. Without further ado, let's start with the Gold Glove Awards in the American League. Starting out in the American League at first base, we have Yuli Gurriel, Matt Olson, and Evan White, who are all in the running and the final three candidates for the award. Now, Seattle Mariners first baseman would go ahead and lock up the gold glove. This is the first of his career. And I do want to add that this year, all of these awards were given based off of strictly sabermetrics and analytics. There was no voting that took place. It was not a popularity contest. It was strictly based on the numbers. And with that, Evan White was the best first baseman defensively out in the AL. Shifting over to second base, Cesar Hernandez, Nicky Lopez, Danny Mendick, and Jonathan Scope were all finalists for this year's gold glove. But Cesar Hernandez will lock up his first gold glove award of the career and taking it home at second base of the Cleveland Indians. At the hot corner, Isaiah, Connor, Falefa, Yoan Moncada, and Gio Urshela were your top three finalists for the award going into it. But Major League Baseball did go ahead and say that IKF, Isaiah, Connor, Falefa, would take home the trophy. This is his first gold glove in his career. And shifting over to shortstop now, our final infield position in the American League. Carlos Correa, J.P. Crawford, and Nico Goodrum were all in the running. But Seattle would go ahead and strike again as their shortstop, J.P. Crawford, takes home the award. So two gold glove defenders in that Seattle Mariners infield. Those were Evan White and J.P. Crawford. Crawford won his first gold glove here in 2020 as well. Now for the outfield awards in the American League, starting in left field. We're going to move from left to right, but out in left field, Alex Gordon, Lourdes Gurriel Jr., and Kyle Tucker were all up for the potential gold glove. But Alex Gordon, who recently called his career and ended it in 2020, is going to go out with a bang. He takes home a gold glove in his final season at a Major League Baseball level. This was Gordon's eighth gold glove award, tied for the most in Kansas City Royals history. Moving out to center field now, Byron Buxton, Ramon Laureano, and Luis Robert were all in the talks. Who was going to go ahead and win the American League center field gold glove? Well, that title goes to Luis Robert, rookie of the Chicago White Sox. And finally, in right field, New York Yankees, Clint Frazier, Texas Rangers, Joey Gallo, and Baltimore Orioles, Anthony Santander were all up for consideration, but Joey Gallo is going to go ahead and take on the 2020 Gold Glove out in the American League right field position. And now for the American League battery, your three pitching candidates were Griffin Canning of the Los Angeles Angels, Kent Maeda of the Twins, and Zach Plezak of the Cleveland Indians. But Griffin Canning from Los Angeles would go ahead and win his first gold glove of his career out here in 2020. Now behind the plate, Yasmani Grandal, James McCann, and Roberto Perez were all considered as the top three finalists at this position, but Roberto Perez would win his second gold glove and his second in back-to-back -back seasons, taking it home for the American League catcher. At first base in the National League now, Brandon Belt, Paul Goldschmidt, and Anthony Rizzo were all up for the award, but Anthony Rizzo of the Chicago Cubs won his fourth gold glove in five seasons here in the 2020 season for his stellar defense at first. Shifting over to second base yet again, but this time in the National League, Adam Frazier of the Pirates, Nico Horner of the Chicago Cubs, and Colton Wong of the Cardinals were all up for the gold glove at second base. But Colton Wong would win his second in back-to-back -back seasons, taking home the gold glove award yet again as that second baseman for the St. Louis Cardinals. At third base now, Brian Anderson, Nolan Arenado, and Manny Machado were your three finalists 
no surprise here as Nolan Arenado wins his eighth gold glove award, the best defensive third baseman potentially in the game, let alone out in the National League. And finally, at shortstop to close out the infields, Javier Baez, Miguel Rojas, and Dansby Swanson were all the three candidates for this award. Javier Baez would win his first gold glove of his career. They have him as the magician for a reason. His nickname is infamous Javi the Magician. He works magic out there at shortstop, and he's going to go ahead and win the gold glove here in 2020. Once again, from left to right in the outfield, this time in the National League, we're starting in left field with Shogo Akiyama, Tyler O'Neill, and David Peralta. Tyler O'Neill of the St. Louis Cardinals took home the gold as he won his first glove award in 2020. In center field, Ronald Acuna Jr., Cody Ballinger, and Trent Grisham, three young guys who absolutely dominated their respective position this season. It wasn't Acuna, it wasn't Ballinger, but Trent Grisham wins the gold glove for this regular season in Major League Baseball. This is his first of the career as well. In right field, Mookie Betts, Charlie Blackman, and Jason Hayward. Mookie Betts, no shock here, wins his fifth gold glove of his career and first out in the National League with the Los Angeles Dodgers. On the mound in the NL, Max Freed, Kyle Hendricks, and Alec Mills, both Hendricks and Mills belonging to the Chicago Cubs, were up for the Gold Glove Award, but on the mound, Max Freed of the Atlanta Braves takes it home for his first Gold Glove Award in his career. And behind the plate for our final position here in the video, Tucker Barnhart, Wilson Contreras, and Jacob Stallings were the three final candidates in the NL behind the plate. Tucker Barnhart wins his second gold glove of his career here in 2020. Alrighty guys, that's going to end it for this video. If you enjoyed, don't forget to drop a like down below, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. A lot of Major League Baseball players took home gold for the first time in their career here in 2020. It was a lot of fun. Those are your gold glove award winners. Thank you all so much for watching. I will see you all next time. Peace.